What's up, Jujutsu nerds? Welcome back to the Matrix channel. Narrated role, me and Steffen. Let's see what happens. I gotta apologize. Um, I watched the role before. And um, even on days, if you're not feeling like doing takedowns or something, well, then do good guard pulls. Don't just do garbage guard pulls like I do here and um, be super lazy. Sorry for that. That's a bad example. So here we have the first garbage way into guard. <laughs> um, I'm fishing for grips, fishing for the shin on shin, got the shin on shin here, come on, un scoot under him, get to shin on shin. But look, his knee, he flares it out to the side and prevents my foot on the hip. Now he should bring even more weight forward, step over or backstep, but he didn't. That's what he can take away here. Also, super often people grab your neck, just strip the grips. Uh, what I do is I pummel inside. Look at my right leg. I pummel it inside. We happen to fall this way. With people with longer legs, you can always go for this position. And I finish a, a quick ankle lock here. Of course, there's so many um, things I can go to from here. Uh, many leg locks, but um, I did not want to uh, go for other leg locks than um, ankle locks in this role and um, avoid leg locks overall with Stefan because he is a beginner. Um, okay, here is pretty conservative, uh, which is not, not a bad idea. Uh, he tries to enter my guard on his terms, which I like, um, should even grip fight more. And um, he, he searches for his uh, opening to the, to the knee slide pass. I think that's his number one pass at the meantime. Uh, in the meantime here, he, he tries to catch the, the um, uh, chin strap. He should go for this more aggressive and then work on his passes, chin strap rolls, stuff like that. Um, <clears throat> again, like here he grabs the head and that's not a good idea because he doesn't have a plan Y and gives me the two on one. I switch to the head, pull it down a little bit. I love doing that. Look at this, my left hand goes to the head. I pull him down, my right leg goes outside to scissor. My left leg elevates him and I get a sweep. Should knee slide here right away, um, let him recover. Try to go for the head. Alex shows that this was two. Thanks, Alex. Um, yeah. <clears throat> Don't like what I do here, really. Lean forward way too much. <clears throat> Happen to pass. Now, isolating the arm, switching my right arm either to his leg, which I do, or to the, uh, to the uh, near side hip, which I prefer. And going to kind of a hybrid of uh, side mount and north south. I love this position. It's very powerful. Now he brings his arm on the inside. I can go for Kimuras, but his wrist is pretty high. Um, I mount to avoid getting uh, thrown to the side and end up in a high mount. He should avoid the high mount at all costs. Look how high I am here. All I have to do is go to S mount, squeeze, um, pick his head up. You, here you see it again. I, I feel like his head is high. I'm like, yeah, cool. That's what I want. I slide up, up, up pull his head up. It's, it's super in, uh, important to pull the head up if you want to go to armbar or mounted triangle in mount. Um, I always do that. M weakens them so much and I can bring, look, boom. And the left knee comes under the head and that's pretty much done at this point. All I have to do is peel the top arm, bring knee to the knee. I don't fall back if I don't have a reason for it. And if I fall back, I underhook the leg for the spider web position. Because arm bars are very easy to escape if you don't do that. Okay, again. Oh my god, that's horrible. <laughs> Keep going. Try to get hooks. He grabs the head, but his weight distribu distribution wasn't that good. So we fall. Um, I pump on my legs here. Again, end up in a, in a mount. So, Stefan. Don't have your arms that high. Again, you saw, saw that he gives me the, the mount, the high mount. So here that's interesting. Usually I never ever go for the mounted triangle without controlling the leg. So here's what I mean by that. Um, look at his left arm. I don't control it with my right hand. I usually pin it down, step on the biceps and then step over for the, for the um, triangle. Um, he gives me, his arm is isolated, his right arm is isolated. So that's always a, a super good opportunity to go for simple submissions like uh, arm bars from there and Americanas. Who says an Americana is a, is a beginner submission? If you do it at the right time, it works. 
Hope you liked it, guys. Please subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell, follow us on Instagram and stay tuned for part two of this role. Os.